My name's Alex Hernandez, and I work at a storage place, and that's in Albany, Oregon. About two years ago, I was uh, living with my brother in Lapine, Oregon, and I was working for a company called United Van Lines. I'd been moving furniture for the last 17 years. I, was, I had a, a dresser and I was taking it up a flight of stairs and I missed a step and I put the dresser into the wall. And then the following week, I took my other car and I was heading to the same job and it was raining, it was six o'clock in the morning on a winter day and I, I drove that car into a ditch. Right then, my wife picked me up and she said, no, we're going to a doctor, there's something wrong. My first doctor was here in Albany and they said, yes, you have cataracts. I can answer a phone, but any part of taking an order or writing a contract down with a customer, I can't do. If I'm walking downstairs, they seem to blend. So at one time, I'd need a rail or I've used my wife's arm and her hand and she'll guide me. My entertainment level is very limited. Uh, television is almost obsolete. When I see it, it comes back to me as a blur, so it's more like me listening to it than actually watching it. I tried playing frisbee with my granddaughter, she's four, and I didn't realize that I threw it at her and I bust her lip open. <laughs> and I really felt bad. My son was kind of making fun of me. He was telling my granddaughter, you know you can't play with Grandpa, he's blind. I really love to golf. I'm an I'm a avid golfer. I, I'm a summer golfer. And since this happened, I've been once. And I went with a friend of mine, Daniel. And fortunately for me, he would see where my ball went. I could address it, which means I could look down and I could see it. But once I, I hit it, I couldn't tell you no, where the ball went. I'm Doug Thompson. I'm the executive director of the Oregon Lions Sight and Hearing Foundation. And we work with about 178 Lions Clubs throughout Oregon and develop relationships with uh, providers like Dr. Matt Neal uh, here in Eugene to help people in need. The Lions Club is kind of famous in the ophthalmology world because of their eye banks. At the university where I trained, the, uh, we always used corneas from the Oregon Lions Eye Bank because they had the best corneas in the whole country. When I uh, came into private practice, I thought, um, you know, looking for a charity to help out with, I thought, what could be more perfect than the Lions Club, you know? Who else has a better heart for vision? Dr. Neal is just very generous. Uh, he and our other surgeons, uh, part of our Mission Cataract team, uh, is willing to to reserve some surgery slots for, for people like Alex in need. And uh, again, due to his generosity and his willingness uh, of be, being a Knight of the Blind, he's able to help Alex. Alex has cataracts in both eyes. Alex is blind from cataracts in both eyes. His cataracts are so bad, he can barely see a hand move a foot from his face. So I'm really excited about uh, doing a surgery because I know that tomorrow, one day after surgery, um, Alex is going to have clear vision and it's going to be amazing. It's going to be life changing. Even though Alex's cataracts are very advanced, uh, removing them is a very routine matter. Um, uh, his prognosis is excellent and I'm expecting him to uh, have very good vision as soon as tomorrow. Alex, we're getting started and everything's looking really good. Get you all set up perfectly. Oh, Alex, this eye is much worse than the other eye. Okay, Alex, you're doing great. We just have a little bit more to go. We're almost done. I walked out this morning and there's a McDonald's mm -hmm. that's down on Gary and Pacific Boulevard. I could see it vividly. 
like my wife said, I keep saying, wow, all the time, you know, like, mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm looking at the people saying, wow, look at that. Yeah. I can actually see that. I'm watching mm -hmm. TV. So. Okay, cool. Well, can I take a look at your eyes under my microscope? Yeah. Thanks. All right. Sorry if I'm blabbing. No, no, that's okay. I, I, I want to hear it. I don't get tired of it. Oh, no. Well, you put your hands on the handlebars. Okay. And your chin goes on the paper. Yeah, they look absolutely perfect. Congratulations. They feel perfect. Thank you. Now, almost everybody finds that some glasses are useful to fine tune their vision mm -hmm. later. So that's what I'll be checking you for in two weeks. Okay. Okay. Congrats. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Wow. Uh, Matthew and your staff, I'd like to, to give my, my thanks and I really don't know how to repay this back. I, I wish it was something, something that I could give you uh, because you definitely gave me the gift of sight again and I have that back and I, I, I'll hold that close to my heart. Just the experience that I had with you and your staff is something that I'll never forget. Face out all I want's your freedom.